Hello everyone, it's Jeremy again. Today I'm going to be doing a new react build today. And this time I'm going to react to the Ian K of his channel called Pizza Out. And the video of his I'm going to react to is called Buffalo Wild Wings Buffalo Bonus Bar Pizza Review. So yeah, and also Michael Vlogs if you're watching this. <laughs> pizza reaction video again. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to be reacting to it. So before I'm going to start, I want to give a disclaimer. If you do not like the content I make, the reaction videos, or any of the other stuff I do on my channel, if you don't like them, then don't watch and go somewhere else. Because the only thing you can be doing is giving me a view, and that's the damn truth, one. That's the damn truth, and not the the truth. So yeah, so now without further ado, let's get to the video right now. Let's get to it right now. Hey, Frosty. Hey, yeah. What's going on, everyone? And welcome no. to the channel. Where today I'm over at Good Old B-Dubs. This time to check out the other mm -hmm. version of their all-new boneless bar pizzas they've got on their menu for a limited time only. Mm. And guys, I gotta say, this one's looking like a work of art. Feast oh, your yeah. eyes on what I've got here for you. Here we go with the Buffalo Boneless Bar Pizza. A mm. very nice situation of colorful oh, yeah. goodness in front of us here right now, guys. Let's mm -hmm. break this one on down real fast. All right, so what we've got here for this version is obviously that thin crust on the bottom topped off with boneless wings, ranch, medium buffalo sauce, blue cheese crumbles, pickled hot peppers, and green onions. And again, guys, a work of art. This is looking very colorful, and I'm loving that ranch drizzle all around this one. Yeah, this one is looking really nice, and I gotta say, not only does it look really nice, it smells pretty nice, too. There's lots of hints of buffalo in the air with this one. So let's not waste any more time on it, guys. This is the all-new Buffalo Boneless Bar Pizza here at P-Dubs. Peep out this flavor. Yes, sir. I'm definitely digging the picture perfect presentation with this one, guys. This looks really, really nice. Almost like it could be like used in the ad. This is really nice. I just ordered this direct like I always do, and this is what I got. Pretty awesome here. So let me pick up one of these pieces. We'll get this going here. Very, very nice. As oh, yeah. you can see, lots of toppings. The drizzling of that ranch is pretty awesome. The bottom looks like it could be cooked a little bit longer, maybe just a little bit, about a minute or so. But this is looking really nice. Here we go, guys. The Buffalo Boneless Bar Pizza here at B-Dub. Let's yeah. beat this out. Mmm. Mmm. Well, right off the break, I gotta tell you, I'm not a super fan of blue cheese. I mean, I never really mm. have been, but when you combine it with ranch, I have to admit, even though the flavor huh. is still kind of there for me, it's not my all-time favorite, I'm definitely digging the overall tang and tartness of the mm. ranch, and a decent amount of the mozzarella cheese, which I think I failed to mention mm. that initial close-up. You can't really call this a pizza without cheese on it, right? So mm. there is an okay amount on here, but guys, the flavor is pretty nice, and the buffalo mm. sauce is pretty beautiful on this here. Let's oh, go yeah. for another couple of bites. Very, very tasty. In fact, let me just pull part of this off here. I can try and balance a little bit of the pepper action mm. on it. Here we go there. Mm. Let's try it with that pepper action. Here we right. go. Mmm. Definitely. I'll leave Buffalo Wild Wings every time. Kind of steaming up with enough. too many new items. First, there was their... Not bad. Their, not bad at all. They even had Doritos, the Wingus. I will think of what I did be on. Very tasty on the boneless chicken itself. And there's their bird dogs and now the and now the their boneless bar pizza. Pretty nicely, but just like that previous version, I think I alluded to it oh, yeah. in that review. This is more of a focaccia type of situation, right not necessarily pizza in the traditional sense, but naturally pretty tasty for what this is. Let's go for another few more bites on it. And I know both of them are different. They're different items that they did before. Let's pull up another one of these bad boys, guys. I'm totally digging the even distribution of the toppings on this one, with the mm. green onions especially. It's a nice garnishment to add even more color to this mm. one. And overall, with those hot peppers and the cheese, and of course, all the boneless chicken action, this is pretty tasty. Definitely a really tasty appetizer situation with a nice amount of that ranch drizzle. I am totally digging that, of course. Mm. Yeah, nothing against the honey barbecue. That was pretty oh, yeah. tasty as well, but this just works on so many different levels, strictly mm. because I think the blue cheese and the ranch is really kind of interesting to me right now. Oh, yeah top of the buffalo sauce and naturally the night light toastiness that I'm getting from the actual crust here I wish it could be just a little bit toastier on the very bottom it looks like it only needs maybe 30 <laughs> seconds to a minute more but still very very flavorful let's go for a couple more bites on this <laughs> mm. very nice <laughs> 
So yeah, I'm glad I saved this variation going on the last guy because I think so I know it's probably why first. This would have been a very very tough act to follow. And naturally with the honey barbecue being what it was, this mm. clearly is the better of the two as far as I'm concerned in my humble huh. opinion. But guys, very very tasty on this one. The combination of the ranch on this of course with the cheese is lovely. Mm. Even with the blue cheese which is kind of there and kind of muting a little bit of the ranch, but I'm totally digging the fact that the ranch is really standing out on top of the buffalo sauce. Very very nice with a decent amount of the boneless chicken. So Let's go for one more bite. We'll wrap the review up with the rating coming up next. But I'm so glad to have checked this one out, guys, because how could I not? Considering there's two of these available on the menu, of course, I wanted to give you the full rounded picture of both of these. So very tasty. We'll go for one more bite and we'll wrap it up. Hang on. Right. Mm. Well, this is definitely a super flavorful boneless bar pizza over here at B-Dubs, a.k.a. a super focaccia as far as I'm concerned, guys. I'm totally digging the overall flavor combo of that ranch and blue cheese, believe it or not. And it goes beautifully with that hot buffalo sauce on top of the pickled hot peppers and, of course, the chicken and a fairly decent amount of mozzarella cheese. A nice combination and easily one to check out. This is pretty tasty. Buffalo Wild Wings. Buffalo Wild Wings. So with that said, I'm going to have to give the Buffalo Boneless quote-unquote bar pizza, a.k.a. the super focaccia as far as I'm concerned, a pretty awesome 9 out of 10 over here at huh. Guys, it really is a pretty tasty situation. And like I said, the combination of the ranch and the blue cheese goes amazing with that buffalo sauce. It's very hard to dive into. I just wish it was cooked just a little bit more on the bottom, but overall, a super tasty appetizer for sure. Oh, yeah. Or if you want to make that a meal, go for it. It's not bad in terms of the size. <laughs> All right, so do me a quick favor like always. Drop those comments down below. If you've given any of these bar pizzas a shot over here at B-Devs, especially if you've tried both of them, which is your personal favorite and why? And out of both mm -hmm. of my reviews that I have live now for you, which did you think looked the best, this variation or the honey barbecue? Mm -hmm. Drop those comments down below. Definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you yeah. here on Peep the Sour Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why you stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, yeah. stay frosty. Stay frosty. Yes, sir. Definitely a beautiful presentation mm. on this one from Buffalo Wings for sure. And mm. now I'm only hoping we come out with some different variations in the future because the execution mm. on this one was pretty banged. All right, everyone. Until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one. And I'm going to stop the video right there. So yeah, and that's the end of this reaction. And I hope you guys like this reaction. I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like it. If you don't, then I don't care. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those notifications bells on. Where we talk about upload and share my videos and reaction videos to your friends and family. Also, if you want to, it's your choice. Because I ain't making it. So yeah. And don't forget to subscribe to NKO's channel called Peep This Out if you Peep This Out. So, like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Subscribe if you haven't yet. Subscribe. Subscribe. And we're in a row to 2K subscribers and maybe 3K subscribers. So, yeah. And that's the end of this reaction film. And I'll see you all for more banger reaction film to come. And I'll see you all in the next time. Dipper Story signing out. And Pizza Story in London. Peace out, everyone. And to you, Michael Vlogs, the torture with the pizza torture. <laughs> so, yeah, see y'all later. Peace out, everyone.